iostudy.net. Hello everyone, this is Danielle, and in this video we're going to talk about the English grammar rules for verb plus preposition 3 about and of. So as you can see here, we have six things to talk about. We're going to discuss the verbs dream, hear, think, warn, complain, and remind. So let's first talk about dream. So from dream, we add about. And we can add of, which means imagine. So dream about. For example, I dreamt about you last night. Dream plus of means imagine. So, for example, I often dream of being rich. This means imagine. Hear. So, to hear about is to be told about something. And to hear of means to know that somebody or something exists. So let's talk about hear about. Here's an example. Did you hear about the fight in the club on Saturday night? So this means to be told about. Now hear of means to know that somebody or something exists. So, who is Tom Madeley? I have no idea. I've never heard of him. So, this means to know that somebody or something exists. So, next verb we're going to talk about is think. You can think about or of. So, to think about, for example, you look serious. What are you thinking about? And thinking of. For example, he told me his name, but I can't think of it now. So these are both using think. So we can say think about or think of. Okay, so those are the grammar rules for those verbs. Now let's go over to this side to learn more. We have the verb warn here. So you can warn about or of. Warn about. Everybody has been warned of the dangers of smoking. And warn of. I knew he was a strange person. I had been warned about him. So as you can see here, we're using about and of. So we can use both of these words with warn. Complain. To complain about means to say that you are not satisfied. And to complain of means to say that you have a pain, etc. So let's look at about, complain about something. So we complained to the manager of the restaurant about the food. Means you are not satisfied. And of, we called the doctor because George was complaining of a pain in his stomach. So it means that you have a pain, etc. Finally, let's look at remind. So remind about means tell somebody not to forget. And remind of means cause somebody to remember. So let's look at the examples. Remind about. I'm glad you reminded me about the meeting. I had completely forgotten it. So tell somebody not to forget. And remind of means 
cause somebody to remember. So for example, this house reminds me of the one I lived in when I was a child. So remind of means cause somebody to remember. Okay, so now we have the mind map completed for a verb plus preposition about and of. So now you can click here to find the outline. For more information, you can read through this to find more information about verb plus preposition about and of. So you can find examples and further situations here. Once you're finished and you want to move on, you can click here to take the test to see how much you know. And in the next video, I will take the test with you. So thanks for joining me in this video where we learned about the grammar rules for verbs plus prepositions about and of. See you again next time. Goodbye.